You wouldn't guess it if you didn't know it, but the anonymous buildings here in central Denmark house the newest chapter in a global wind energy story. It's uh, 2,000 square meters of concrete floor, a bit of walls and two 20-ton cranes. And that's pretty much what it takes to make somewhere between 1 and 60 turbines a year. The nacelles, bound for a wind farm in neighboring Sweden, are part of Envision Energy's new 3 megawatt onshore turbine and actually the first to be produced outside China. It shows that we are committed to this region, so not only this client will, will see that we are, we are here, but also other clients in Europe uh, can see this uh, assembly factory and can come and, and see the, the, the turbines. That makes them feel that we are, we are close uh, and that we, you could say, are here for a long-term solution. While Envision as a company is in Europe for the long term, this assembly unit is of a much more temporary nature. It reflects a flexible and agile production philosophy that can be set up and closed down quickly, utilizing existing buildings and close to market. Usually what it takes about six to eight months to source a gearbox, and that's the time we need to set up the factory. Inside the regional assembly hub is a fully mobile and ISO 9001 certified process. The logistic flow inside the factory, we have set that one up. We have the kit sets ready, we have every, all the parameters ready. So it's only finding a place and maybe, worst case, fitting it with cranes, if it doesn't have cranes already. The regional assembly process originates at Envision's main factory in Jiangyin, outside Shanghai, where many of the central parts begin their journey towards the customer. From Jiangyin, the main structure, casted parts and nacelle covers are sent to the regional assembly hub. Here they're joined by other main components as converter, gearbox, main bearing, cooling module and generator, and the whole thing is assembled by a small team close to the customer. The customer would always like that suppliers are as close as possible, not just for the uh, product supply, but also going forward that they see that we are strong in that region. The 3 megawatt turbine was developed at Envision's nearby Global Innovation Centre and certified at Denmark's National Test Centre for large wind turbines. This has been a factor when planning the production in Denmark. It's very important actually to keep a production facility close by the developing centre as well. If we want to receive all the good information back from production and improve our product. It takes roughly four weeks to finalise each nacelle at the regional assembly hub. From there, the nacelles are shipped to the wind farm where they're joined by the hub, tower sections and blades. And even though the entire operation covers more than eight countries, it has the potential to leave a regional or even local footprint. What happens when you move in with a 60 turbine park somewhere is that you have a huge massive a logistic train coming in with all your turbines, your towers and everything and you have very little engagement in the community. Whereas this one is kind of, this moves in through the municipality, it employs the people of the region, it employs the people of the city, so it becomes a part of the city. That's a very strong uh, sales parameter too. It's the individual business case that determines if this type of pop-up regional assembly is suitable. It's always a mix of uh, cost and uh, uh, infrastructure, logistic considerations that need to be uh, taking place. Is it just for this uh, one project or is it a, a, a continuous uh, production that would take place over years? Uh, of course, uh, then we will establish more to make uh, the production more uh, as a zero production. But if you're planning a small to medium sized wind farm, Christian Bedmar and his team at Envision Energy are ready to set up production quickly, close by. The actual time is the lead time of the gearbox and the main bearing and uh, two to three months of preparation and assembly time. So approximately 12 months from, from you press go and pay the money until, <laughs> until you have the first turbines.